<laughs> this is Alan Neander speaking to you from Guitar Point Vintage Guitars in Mainzhal, Germany. And this is a 1970 Hagstrom. I have to look for the Viking a Swedish guitar. It is a Swedish guitar, and, but they were quite common in the United States around the 60s. And I've, I don't know whether you've ever seen the film about the Wrecking Crew, the famous studio crew that recorded pretty much all American pop music from the 60s. Beach Boys and everything, and you see uh, guys playing Hackstrom guitars there. You know, they, they, I bet they could afford uh, everything, but uh, they played. You see Hackstrom in the film, so it was quite common in the states. But around that time, this is of course is is a guitar. It's probably derived from a uh, 330, yes, 330, or uh, a casino. It has a bolt on neck, which kind of. Uh, adds a little different little different twang that you wouldn't normally find in a Gibson or in an Epiphone. So if you into these kind of quirky guitars that are not common, you know, and you you know you're curious, you want to discover different sounds, there's a lot of like to be discovered in this field where you know people try to make uh, a, a guitars that resemble the famous big brands but somehow you know we're slightly different and sometimes unfavorable but a lot of times in a favorable way so so tr try these guitars out since they're still affordable and they breathe so much vintage mojo and of really individual instruments uh, I recommend trying them out because you have you you come up with different ideas. This is a 1970 Hockstrom Viking, and this is Alan Yander from Guitar Point Vintage Guitars in Mainzell, Germany. Thank you. Bye-bye.